Elon Musk has read the encyclopedia twice. As a child, the encyclopedia showed him how different things are connected. When starting PayPal, Elon bought a book about banking to learn how it worked. And when starting SpaceX, Elon read a Soviet-era rocket manual and studied rocket books from friends. So what would Elon Musk's library look like today? Here are the top books that he recommends people to read, with notes, learnings, and highlights covering what each book is about and what Elon thinks about them. You can find links to each book in the description below. Nick Bostrom's book Super Intelligence, Paths, Dangers, and Strategies asks whether machines will one day take over the human race on Earth. The Swedish philosopher argues that the survival of gorillas now depends more on humans than on the gorillas themselves. The future of humanity might be dictated by the super intelligent machines that we create. Bostrom suggests that there may be an intelligence explosion as machines teach themselves how to get smarter, and the intelligence of humans would be left far behind. Elon Musk is even funding Nick Bostrom's research. He recommended the book in a tweet, saying, We need to be super careful with AI, potentially more dangerous than nukes. As Bostrom discusses in the book, an ultra-intelligent machine could benefit humanity, so long as the machine is docile enough to tell us how to keep it under control. Elon keeps his eye on artificial intelligence by investing in companies, saying that it is not from the standpoint of actually trying to make any money from the investments, but that he likes to keep an eye on what is going on with artificial intelligence. He thinks that there is a potentially dangerous outcome here. Elon started OpenAI, an artificial intelligence research lab, and he invested in DeepMind, an AI that has been taken over by Google. And you won't just find one book on artificial intelligence in Elon Musk's library. He also recommends Life 3.0, Being Human in the Age of Artificial Intelligence by the MIT cosmologist Max Tegmark. Tegmark's book discusses how AI may eventually replace humans through automation, and that it could either give us the opportunity to flourish like never before, or the power to destroy ourselves. Elon endorsed the book on Twitter, saying that it was worth reading and that AI will be the best or worst thing ever for humanity. So let's get it right. For the next Elon Musk book, we are going to the fictional side of the library. His next book recommendation is the classic sci-fi novel The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy by Douglas Adams. The book tells the story of Arthur Dent, who is saved from the destruction of Earth by an alien, Ford Prefect. Dent then finds himself wandering the universe in search of the meaning of life. Elon has said that his philosophical foundation is in line with Douglas Adams. He first read The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy as a teenager, saying that, I guess when I was around 12 or 15, I had an existential crisis, and I was reading various books on trying to figure out the meaning of life and what does it all mean. It all seemed quite meaningless. The book helped Elon Musk to realize that the question is harder than the answer, and if you can properly phrase the question, then the answer is the easy part. This powerful insight has played a critical role in Elon's life, driving him to ask the tough questions and looking for answers with ambitious ventures such as SpaceX and Tesla. He even put the iconic words from the book Don't Panic on the center screen of the Tesla Roadster when he launched it into orbit. And then there was the Starship prototype that had the number 42 written on it, with Elon Musk referencing The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy again, life, the universe, and everything. Next in the Elon Musk library is a book that he credits as one of the things that helped him move from a coding background to rocket science. The book is called Structures, or Why Things Don't Fall Down, by J.E. Gordon. Elon says that it is really, really good if you want a primer on structural design. The book explains how engineering works in a simple and accessible way. It covers topics such as how skyscrapers are designed and why suspension bridges don't collapse, making complex scientific principles easy to understand. Elon Musk has made it clear that he didn't become a structural engineer at SpaceX by choice, saying that the reason I ended up being the chief engineer or chief designer was not because I wanted to. It's because I couldn't hire anyone. Nobody good would join. This book helped him start SpaceX. As well as Douglas Adams, another one of Elon's heroes is the inventor and U.S. founding father Benjamin Franklin. Elon recommends reading Walter Isaacson's biography of Franklin. It discusses his experiments with kites and electricity, which led to the development of lightning rods and his invention of bifocal lenses. Elon describes Franklin as one of the people I most admire. The biography helped Musk understand Franklin's entrepreneurial drive, saying that he was an entrepreneur. He started from nothing. He was just a runaway kid. It's not surprising 
that Elon rates Franklin as pretty awesome, given they both share a strong desire to improve the world and find solutions to build a better society. Back in the fictional side of Elon Musk's library, there is the Foundation Trilogy by Isaac Asimov. Written in the 1940s, the story is set around 50,000 years in the future, taking place in a fictional universe. Here, mathematician Harry Seldon studies the future of global populations. He realizes that civilization as we know it will come to an end. Harry then tries to come up with solutions to prolong civilization and to preserve human knowledge. Elon told Rolling Stone magazine that the lessons he learned from the Foundation are that you should try to take the set of actions that are likely to prolong civilization, minimize the probability of a dark age, and reduce the length of a dark age if there is one. Elon also tweeted, saying that the Foundation series and Zeroth Law were fundamental to the creation of SpaceX, referring to Asimov's Law of Robotics, which are designed to protect the human race.